I always knew I would be an artist. It was just in me. I knew that he was great, and he was going to be someday something, you know, special. He's an amazing uh, resource, just a phenomenal, wonderful, dedicated artist and really is a master at his craft. He has wonderful art that's on display. He's well known around the state and he's, he's just a, a very good instructor. When I first met Tom was in our last year in high school and uh, we met in a history class. I did a portrait of her and her teacher saw that portrait, she had art, and said, I want to put him in for a scholarship. I was the first one to get a scholarship from Eastside High School to the Newark School of Fine and Industrial Art. After he finished with, with school, graduated from the art school, that's when we did get married. We were married a year and then he was um, drafted. That kind of put a hold on our whole life. I was drafted in 1965. Uh, during the uh, Vietnam conflict and while I was in Vietnam I was severely hurt. It's hard to say. Uh, most of my the main injuries were in both arms and hands. I found out that I lost the use you know I was paralyzed uh, and had no use so I had a friend and he was injured and he would ask me constantly what I did. And finally I told him I was an artist and he said, you really work? Can you draw anything? I said, I can't even hold a pencil. So eventually he got me to tape a pencil to my cast and I started to just make marks, and then before you know it, I could draw pretty good. Even though I have bent up fingers and still paralysis, I'm able to work. And the thing that I was blessed with is to be able to help others because of my uh, experience, the knowledge that I have now, and to be able to help others and to be personable with them and to try to understand them, to deal with them not to be negative, but to be positive. That's what I would like, the legacy I would like to leave, that I am giving them something or giving the ones in the future something that they understand the way I looked at it, the way I saw life. He's just such a phenomenal teacher. His ability is, is beyond none I've ever seen. And um, I've learned a lot from him, and I enjoy his class. Uh, I've learned a lot from Tom. I've learned about mixing colors, about painting skies, doing trees, you know, lots of things that I would never have known. He's, he's really, he's a very good teacher, and, and he's not intrusive. He doesn't get on you. He, you know, he stays with you. The work of art that I'm most proud of is this particular one behind me here. It's called Friends at Liberty. That happens to be the one that has won most awards that I've ever won. Every show that was ever in, it's been in lots of shows. How do I feel about being nominated? Happy, happy. I didn't expect it, uh, it's just, uh, I'm so happy about it, I'm grateful about it. But I just, you know, I, I asked my wife when she first told me, are you sure they're talking about me? You better check on the name. <laughs> but you don't expect it, you know, but, um, so it was a surprise, but a happy surprise. I was really happy about it. Always try to put out your best. You're spending some of your life, your breath, uh, your brain power, so put out your best. Just don't make a statement. Make a profound statement. <laughs>